Hey, what's up, my friends? How are you doing? Um, plant more trees in the house, in your house, in your video, one more time. And um, today I'm gonna introduce to you this uh, project that we're doing. As you can see, we have a new planting, and what this is here it's called a Miyawaki style forest and what is it what's a Miyawaki style forest um, I'll, I'll give you a brief introduction right now as we see this and then we will have um, a few videos come up where we go a little more into detail maybe some interviews with the people who are helping us do this and uh, I'll tell you, this is a highly dense, it's a densely planted forest, all with native plants to the region that you're planting in. And um, we've been working with this uh, crew, um, it's called Natural Urban Forests. And um, the idea behind this forest it's a little unconventional uh, compared to your regular um, urban forestry and what it is is um, that these plants are so densely planted together um, they have a better uh, interaction with each other uh, in terms of uh, fungal uh, connectivity in the soils and they grow 10 times faster than a than a regular um, you know reforestation effort so um, yesterday we we spent all day with um, children and or contractors and uh, some volunteers um, planting this it was really beautiful um, we have about um, 600 plants in here and yeah <laughs> it's a lot uh, but uh, I'm really happy to say that um, we had uh, some blessings from our uh, Native American elders uh, blessing the land and blessing the the plants and the project it was really beautiful um, and we have all native plants here <clears throat> we had one of our uh, science teachers um, really kick butt and um, do a lot of this uh, work uh, behind the scenes pushing forward making it happen um, and it was quite amazing um, this project has been um, quite a challenge to make it happen uh, we had little time to prepare and there's some things that can be done better for the future ones but um, we have uh, let's count one two three four five five species of trees um, we have about 12 uh, 13 species of uh, shrubs we have um, um, some about another 10 species of uh, of uh, more uh, ground cover and uh, they're planted about a foot and a half away from each other and um, they're they're all California native plants um, and the funny thing is that they uh, these all these plants they don't occur naturally together okay their relationships are not always um, together uh, but uh, as these uh, plants grow and compete for uh, resources um, they will have um, some plants will um, just uh, not make it and some plants will most plants will um, 
the records show us that uh, the survival rate is uh, between 90 and 95 percent which is pretty amazing for a um, afforestation project or reforestation I've worked at a um, at an um, environmental restoration company where we did uh, uh, reforestation and uh, habitat restoration and um, we planted in one site 17,000 trees and out of those 17,000 trees we had about a 60% uh, survival rate after five years and still that's a lot um, when you plant 17,000 trees that's a lot of trees that survive and create this uh, habitat now here we have um, this highly dense plant densely planted forest as you can see um, as you can see the deer fencing uh, this is a deer sensitive area where deer come and go and they would munch on these young little plants so fast so we so we put this up um, and uh, I'm really looking forward to the next couple days where we'll have uh, more of this uh, forest planted we have two more one is a little bigger than this one uh, this one is about uh, 800 square feet and the next one is about a thousand and the last one is about uh, 5,000 square feet so anyway I'm really looking forward to uh, completing this project and in the next couple of videos I will create a playlist and um, bring to you a few interviews with the people who have um, uh, helped put this project together and um, help execute it and first of all let me let me just uh, go ahead right now and express my gratitude um, this project has been uh, a little stressful but uh, uh, my family has been there for me helping me out uh, my friends my colleagues um, or contractors who have uh, who have brought this to us um, the principals at the schools have been very supportive and um, and here we go um, it's a it's a really cool project I'm very very happy I love most of these plants <laughs> no I love them all I love them all but uh, anyway I wanted to just express my gratitude to everybody involved all the children who were here planting and helping out uh, getting their hands dirty and uh, we'll go from there we will have uh, more videos coming up in the next couple of days and um, anyway let's uh, we'll, we'll bring you more content about uh, this afforestation project all right and that's it for now I have to keep doing my work catching up on a couple of things but I wanted to present this to you as the first introduction we'll go a little more into detail of species selection and um, and and who these plants are all right we'll talk uh, soon I'll see you in the next video if you like this uh, video please like it and subscribe if you don't like it uh, hit the thumbs down you can go ahead and leave me a comment tell me why you liked it what or why you didn't like it and let's uh, let's uh, keep planting more trees all right I will talk to you soon and as always, plant more trees, peace.